Hello and welcome to the Lucion video tutorial series. In this video, we'll talk about using a flatbed scanner with File Center. Now, first of all, let's make sure that we're all understanding the terms the same way. A flatbed scanner is like a photocopier. It has a glass surface, and you place your document face down on the glass and then scan one page at a time. This is as opposed to a sheet fed scanner or a document scanner, which are usually upright and they have a document feeder where you can place a whole stack of documents and the scanner will pull the pages through one at a time, usually very quickly. Now if you're using a flat big scanner, this is a great option for scanning photographs, receipts, and it even works fine for very short documents. But if you're scanning fairly lengthy documents often, you really ought to consider switching over to a document scanner, a sheet fed scanner. They scan much more quickly and they're much, much easier to use. You'll get through a lot more scanning in a lot shorter of a time. Now for the rest of this video, we'll assume that you need to scan your documents with a flatbed scanner, and we'll show you how to do that as easily as possible with File Center. Now there are a couple of settings that matter to a flatbed scanner. Here in our scan dialog, you'll notice first of all, use flatbed. There are some flatbed scanners that won't work unless you select that option, so make sure that that's selected. And then the second one for document scanning on a flatbed is right here. Prompt for more. What that means is after each sheet is scanned, File Center is going to ask if there are more sheets that you want to scan. And if there are, those sheets will go into the same scan. So that way you can get one unified document even though you're scanning one page at a time. Now, you'll probably want to default to these settings for your flatbed. To default to them, just click the Save button right here. And that will make it so that every time your scan dialog comes up, these are automatically selected. Now let's go ahead and run a scan so that you can see how this works. Okay, the first page is being scanned, and now File Center is going to pause and ask if there are additional pages we want to scan. And there are, so let me load another page onto the scanner. And we'll click Yes. Okay, and you'll notice over on the left that that page was added to our current scan. So I don't need to do multiple documents and stitch them together. File Center is automatically going to build this document one page at a time. And let's go ahead and do a third page. Okay, and there's our third page. And I'm done now. So when I'm done scanning, I click No. I don't want to add any more pages to the document. And there's our completed three-page document. And now I could just save that out as one unified document. Now let's switch over to the Manage view so that you can see how this works over here. Just as I did before, I'm going to scan a three-page document. So let's hit the Scan button. And you'll notice that uh, these are defaulted to being selected because I saved that option before. Let's call this New Will. It's a new scan. I'm going to be prompting for more pages. Let's go ahead and start our scan. Okay, the first page comes through. And just like we expected, File Center automatically prompts for more pages. Here we go with our second page. And one more page. And we're done with our documents, so we'll say no more pages. And that's it. Our document is done. And if we open the file preview, we can see that we have a three-page document done with our flatbed scanner. So there you can see that not only is it possible to scan a multi-page document with a flatbed scanner in File Center, File Center will do everything it can to make that as painless for you as possible. 